Chris. We're heading to the Olympic Park for a quick photo shoot with a new kill. For some reason, Chris has turned up on that ridiculous TT bike. But you know what, mate? It's getting hot. It's getting hot. Yeah. How are you, man? How are you? Yeah, alright. <laughs> and come in and use it. That does mean other people can use it as well. So, so you've got to be a bit aware that there might be people on the track. Great for a little training loop though. And pretty handy when you want to take some photos. Chris is on his full TT setup. He's trying to get as much time on the bike as possible because he's got a race coming up. Not the Nationals yet though. We've got a few months to prepare for that. Pain in the arse keeping up with him on this bike though. It's just so aerodynamic. So there we go. First batch of photographs done. I'll put a few that you can have a look at here. I think it's time for a coffee break. We're trying to meet up with Jimmy somewhere. Where is he? He's quite small, you can't always find him. I think he's the back of that building. Oh, why have you taken your TT hat off? Uh, I don't need the gains now, I'm with you riding normally. I've got the gains from the disc wheel. Right, Dad. Right, mate. I didn't get the kit memo, did I? No. Nice and soft, though. Yeah, I'm soft. I'm warm. Yeah. We thought you'd turn up on the BMX. Disappointed on all counts. Can you go back and come back again? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Emily had the... You twat. I thought it was me, I was, I was gonna, I haven't got any tubes left. No, you haven't got stupid tyres, that's alright. If I hold it here, it's fine. Road tubeless doesn't work, mate. It doesn't work. It doesn't this is a perfect example of it not working. How have you still got air in it? I might have to get the new tyres put on when I get back. I might actually go to get the new tyres put on. How are you going to get home? Uh, ride quickly. You're not going to get home like that. It's still rock solid. It was jizzing out now. How has it still got pressure in it? Because he bro? started with 400 psi. It's been doing this for ages. I Why mean, has it got red coming out of it? That Some is a sort of fungus. Oh, the worm. Keep spinning it, it might see it. It's probably run out of fucking ceiling. <laughs> Bollocks. I've gone through eight tubes in the last 12 hours. And when I heard that tyre going, I thought, once again, my wheels were popped, but they're fine. I've got no tubes left. Why have you gone eight through eight tubes? I messed up the rim tape on my, on my new wheels. There's not many tubes, is it? You didn't go through the door either. I told you he was going the wrong way. Through the door. Why do you like that? Why do I like what? Going through the door, it's a bit weird. You've got to go through the door, otherwise you can't get out, <laughs> can you? Yeah. Which, which other way would you go? Straight into a wall, otherwise. It's a dead end. You gonna crash? So while I'm here near Jimmy's place, just quickly head over to their office. So there's one bit of Atticus kit that I've been meaning to get my hands on. Now it's ready, I'm gonna nick it off Jimmy. You'll see. That's what I've been waiting for. What, five bucks? Yeah, thanks so much. Now this, but only to be worn, I think only to be worn with black kit. I think that is going to become the the AJ look. So with all the crazy Audax stuff that he does, this is his like go-to bit of visibility. Yeah, because you can be seen in it. He sent me a picture that he took going up some like shadowy climb, all in black, but with this on it, it just like pops. And if you're too hot, you can just have it unzipped and you can still be seen. And he lives in the north and it's never warm there anyway, so it's probably always gilet weather. AJ's not north. Ludlow, north. <laughs> Anything above London, that's the it, north. Yeah, it is technically above. How's everything been going? You sold everything yet? No, hopefully that won't actually happen because that would be disappointing. Why would that be disappointing? Well, because then there might be people which can't get what they want to get. It'd be good to not sell out and that we actually can get enough stuff that people can actually get what they want. Continuously, the biggest struggle we have being a very small business is exactly that, you know? Stock. Yeah, 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 absolutely. You know, it's, it's not easy. You know, we don't have corporate backing and you know everything we've done, we've done just on ourselves. So it's, it's, a, it's a challenge. I've got any viewers who have a billion pounds. <laughs> Give Jimmy an email. You have stock of everything. Yeah. <laughs> Kafir would be able to get his bib shorts. Yeah, I'm sure they can find my email address if they are billionaires. <laughs> <laughs> They'll just pay someone to do it. Mate, what's this? Are you getting a tattoo? Oh, that's three amigos. It's a, a skate shop. Oh, you, I, I like, I haven't actually told you. Me and Emily got some skateboards and we started skating on the weekend. We're actually- That's why you're dressing like- no, this is just hipster attire. You just go. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard learning new skills when you're an adult. Um, and we like, one of uh, the dudes we know runs Three Amiga Skate Shop. Um, they're just like an independent based in Camden. We're just hanging around with him. He's full of tattoos. He's just cool. He's just like, he's so cool. Up to the brim. He's, he's full to the brim of tattoos. Eat him. Eat him. <laughs> what? 
and we, we like hung around with him a couple of times and we're just like this, you know, this guy's cool and obviously we hung around with Pritchard a few times he was just like the epitome of like cool skater why why not why not try skating so Richard sorted us out a couple of boards did you fall off no we haven't we've been really like because we're adults were being very cautious <laughs> neither of us have fallen off yet although I did come close I've got a skateboard no you don't uh, do you really? 100% yeah oh my I God. cannot do can't do anything good I can just go fast but that's like that's the, that's the starting point you know just moving use it, it to get around because you haven't got to lock it up I found out there's actually like a particular way that you're supposed to carry a skateboard it's apparently if you carry it by the trucks it's called a mall grab which is not cool but then I, you know what I say about rules you can call me the mall the mall grab <laughs> we bought we bought um pads as well elbow knee and wrist pads oh very adult of you yeah, yeah. i want to be able to do an ollie because i could never do it as a kid it's essentially the same as a bunny hop you can only do a cleat skirt i can do a clip too <laughs> <laughs> imagine um a skateboard where you like where you did have essentially cleats and you like clipped into it would that be amazing or would it be horrible because it's kind of like a street snowboard i personally think it's a bad idea <laughs> <laughs> i really like your bike I take it for like, a spin i like these as well these are really cool if i just like old man steals bike crashes bicycle old man what are you talking about old man oh bald man that's all right Hydro discs are the best, These are new pads and they're not quite worn in yet oh, as well. The shifters are quite a lot lower than mine. The general geometry is probably quite similar to what I ride, but this is, I, I, I run my shifters a lot more up these days. You set them up so the handles, like, that you can do that exactly. Oh yeah, Eric Wanker. All the racing I'm doing. All the racing, yeah. yeah. All of the zero racing you're doing. I might do one. Which one? A race. Oh, just a, just a generic race? Yeah. Why don't you do the March Hare? That's the one that everyone does. Is that the one Chris crashed in last year? Yeah, You're a little bit late for it anyway. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going home. Right, See you later. Nice easy spin back through the park now. Annoyingly my IT band's flaring up again, so I've got to take it a little bit easy. And the sun's gone in. What's going on with this? <laughs>